Hello guys, hello and welcome to another episode of Hearts on 4, Modern Day Mod and the Kingdom of North Korea. Last episode, we begun our invasion of China and as you might see, it's going quite well. We have a slight problem with being extremely thinly spread out, which I think I'm gonna try to fix ASAP. So if I would grab this unit... And tell you to just go up right here. The same with you. So first we're gonna slightly increase our front line. But then hopefully we're gonna cut it off by quite a bit. And I hope that you infantry divisions can just clean up the rest right here. And then just be as reassigned as a general backup to this entire front line. That would help my pushing abilities quite a bit. But I don't know. Uh, that's only two provinces. Let's see if you can go up right there instead. Uh, you can please attack right here just so we can, well, intercept any kind of reinforcements that might, might arrive. Yeah, good. And you, my dear tank, just keep going right there. Very good. Uh, let's just continue with infrastructure upgrades for now. Uh, my infantry divisions. Actually, how are we doing with equipment? Oh god, we're not doing good at all with equipment. Um, all of you guys need to just stop and really really just relax we're taking way too much damage right there and if you take too much damage then we can't reinforce these divisions if well if they attack me right there so we have the shill of it uh, mechanized we're still fine with uh, let's see motorized we're fine with tanks we're fine with okay so the very 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 important stuff we're still fine with but still I would prefer it if we were not lacking that much anti-tank anti-air artillery and infantry equipment infantry equipment is actually the most critical things because that we need for every single one of our divisions uh, we have one line on it is one line really enough I we don't have one line on it we have many more lines on it right 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 we were talking about this problem last episode too and we didn't really manage to fix it then come on just break that single province and everything will be alright no not really but it's a good first step. Come on, just yes, yes, break it. Come on, come on, you can do it. Come on, just yes, break it. Yes, good. And now all of your divisions assigned right there. No one should be assigned right there. Good. And then all 25 divisions right here can you just unite and welcome. Really? Really? You managed to break me instantly? Destroying my plans two f in two freaking seconds? Uh, no, attack right here. Do not let them intercept or do anything stupid. Come on, just break them. Every single division right here, just break them. Wow, you really, you really assigned a ton of troops right here to prevent me from doing this. No, 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 no. That's not freaking acceptable. We're gonna counterattack and we're gonna break them. And right here, they seem to be pushing back. Well, the same thing right here. They're trying to somehow break my push forward. No. No. No, no, no. China, what are you doing? You're supposed to fall. This was supposed to be an easy episode for me. I was just going to chill while we kill the last remains of you. You're not going to start some kind of counter movement. Come on, just get in there. Very good. Let's see. You guys, uh, you need to attack right here. Yeah, God, that's that's just horrible. You're way too strong suddenly. Okay, we have broken them right now. But is this enough, really? No, no, holy shit. That's not close to enough. Everyone assigned right here. All the red divisions right there. Please be assigned right here. Cool. Now we're going to remove that line. Now hopefully we're gonna hold this position, just in case I'm gonna build, I'm gonna build two level forts, <laughs> two forts level like right up there, right ASAP as quickly as freaking like possible to see if I can hopefully counteract them this time. Uh, you should probably get down there and defend that front. Let's see, while down here, uh, invitation from China. The Chinese government put forward a proposal where we join the military alliance in, in order to enhance the regional security and further mutual address. We accept this doesn't feel right. <laughs> oh, that's cute, China, trying to somehow stop us. Macau, you're in the... Okay. Wow. 
Hong Kong join. Now you fell. Literally two seconds after you joined them, you instantly fell. Was that was that a good choice from you? Was that a good choice? And very soon Hong Kong is also gonna fall. Now I think I think nations have made better choices before, and uh, yeah, I think you're gonna regret your choice. Uh, let's see what the hell happened with our. Yeah, we're still building forts, but we actually managed to push in right here. So that no, no that fort is useless. So let's remove those. And you guys, well, okay, fine. Let's just use one of these divisions to clean up a bit more right there. Otherwise, I I don't get it. Why are you losing so much equipment? I know you're taking attrition, but... Really? Really? You're taking this much attrition by you standing around? You, sh you shouldn't take this much equipment losses. What the hell is wrong with you? You're just generally dying by standing around. There's nothing special with you. You should be fine. I know it's kind of bad terrain, but really, that you lose so much equipment that you'll barely be able to sustain yourself. That, that's, that's just crazy. That's just pure crazy. There we go, we wiped out some shiny situations, and that was another 100,000 their men, so that's at least good. Um, yeah, all of these red divisions, just try to get around here, and then somehow... Actually, all of you guys, just be unassigned. Be assigned, hold. Uh, let's see, how's the supply situation right here? Yeah, it's really, really bad. But still, it shouldn't be this bad. Uh, let's try to fix... Let's try to fix this, okay. Level 4 right there, we need to fix right here, we need to fix right there. Anywhere else? Yep, there, we need to fix this infrastructure. God, there's so much infrastructure that needs to be done. What the hell have you been doing in China and India? You know, infrastructure is actually a pretty good thing, so... I would kind of recommend you usually build infrastructure. Holy crap, everything is basically destroyed. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a slight change up here. Uh, since everything seems to be very very bad, I'm just gonna reduce everything to a level three standard instead of a level four. Um, that's a level four. Let's see right there, level four, level three, level three. There we go. Everything fine now. Right there, right there. Holy crap! It was. And I've been doing air bases now. Oh god! I wonder. <laughs> I, I, I knew it, it couldn't be that bad. Yeah, everything is usually kind of fine except these areas. Holy crap. <laughs> I was doing air bases. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. Okay, yeah, the nation isn't as bad as I thought. I was like, this doesn't make sense. I would have fixed this if it was that bad before. This makes m so much more sense. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of happy again. Oh, well, I'm not super happy. I'm still gonna piss why you're losing so much equipment, but it kind of makes sense now <laughs> Okay, why we, we simply can't sustain the troops right there I think By the supply and the supply is multiplied by the desert area that is multiplied by The low supply and blah blah, blah and that takes a ton of attrition something like that uh, Let's see production efficiency production cap, but that's 100 more days. Uh, I think we'll wait a tiny bit with that then. Uh, that's Yen Fighters level 5. That's, well, not out of time, so let's pick you. What the hell is going on? 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 Okay, it, we were safe. <laughs> I, I thought I saw a bump of shiny units right here. Oh, shite. That scared the crap out of me. Because if they manage to push in right there, I don't think I can stop them. God, that scared the crap out of me. That truly, truly scared the crap out of me. Because that would have been game over. Game over, man. Game over. Oh, no. We're safe. Okay, cool. Uh, what should we do? Resource focus could actually... Oh, yeah. That could actually be something good right now. Because that's a lot of resources we would be able to get. But let's just get the first or last infrastructure before we begin. Uh, let's see. All of these red divisions are standing around right now. 
taking well taking a shield pill uh, let's see where the, where's no where there's no divisions you're allowed to move in otherwise you will stand still and I'm thinking right here what if I just assigned you all under one big field marshal instead sure I would lose these bonuses but everyone would be able to be supported by a good guy God, we need to reduce a front. We definitely need to reduce this front as much as possible. Come on, just bring it down. Thank you. This is a couple of provinces of help. Uh, I'm actually gonna do something like this. Okay, uh, let's grab you three divisions and just reassign down here. Wait, not all of you are actually assigned to this front line. Holy crap, that's that's something wrong with that. Yeah, um, I'm just reducing this one because this one's actually really short now. This one is much larger. So let's, instead of, well, dribbling back and forward, just reassign a couple of divisions. Like, I don't think they have personal preferences. They just want to be assigned to a 24 stack. That is pretty good. And since he's a better leader, I think they will be fine with that. <laughs> uh, let's see. God, I'm maybe mad. Talking about, like, my units have different feelings about preferences, where they want to be assigned uh let's see you are yeah you're still moving now good supply wise we're doing slightly better especially within infantry equipment that we're doing fine uh let's see you're barely not you can't be counted as anything because while well, you don't have any equipment the same thing right there and you can just move in okay seems like we have completely shut them out of all kinds of supply so i think we should just be able to move in right now and remove every everything right here both of you just get in there, yeah, yeah. This won't be, a, this won't even be a fight. This will just be me walking in. Cool, and you take the last one. Yeah, nice. So that entire area should now just disappear from the map. Uh, please move in like this, and you move in like that. Come on, overrun them, overrun them. Nice, very good, very good. Can I actually see those losses, please? No, I can't because they're overrun. Damn it. Uh, let's see if I want to reduce the front so if oh wait wait that would just increase the front by a ton even though it, well eventually it would reduce the front but right now it just be an increase so yeah yeah let's let's just wait with it then uh, China how close are you to actually surrender 20% more 20 freaking percent more hmm that would basically be uh, these two cities and I think I'm done after that yeah that'd be nice um, so, let's see, Japan, you are definitely my next enemy. Missile Cruiser level 2 and 3. God, that's not good enough, that's not good enough. Uh, you are gonna be reduced to a single line, oh, not even that, you're gonna be reduced to two convoys right now. Or, come, bottom down, alright, because we have other stuff in the way. Uh, more Missile Cruisers, we need a hell of a lot more Missile Cruisers. Uh, let's see if we need to trade with someone then we're gonna trade for it. Hello US I know I'm going to war with you kind of soon, but until that moment, please give me everything you have uh, Let's see. We have many more military factories very good. Uh, let's see Air Force We probably have to bump that one up to at least two full lines um, Air experience you're probably gonna be spent until on the generation 5 fighters that are coming quite soon but until that moment just get me as much as possible and uh, let's see mechanized fine tanks we're fine and we're producing quite a bit of it good then we have reserve and we have a decent well force of units coming always so please it's time to remove shine up just take nanjin all oh, right we will lose a ton of stuff once we actually take it because they become well not our core state which means we lose probably half of it in most of the most important places at least yeah all of you just get the other Shangyin, Shanghai <laughs> Shangyin what the hell was I reading Shanghai uh, just move in there and grab it remove them from the map it's time to end this war the time of China is over the time for the kingdom of North Korea has come you guys, um, yeah, it was pretty much just a cakewalk. But it seems like I missed a couple of provinces, so let's just clean this up. Oh, 
Come on, move in. And you go right here, and half of you go right there. And half of you in there. Good, good. So, there we go, and you did not fall. Yes, you did. Very nice. And that's a hell of a lot of extra stockpile equipment. And three, two, one. Thank you for everything. It was a pleasure doing business with you. And boom. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Someone said, do not take all the China. Because of the research stuff. Let's see, what would China have had? Yeah, exactly the one I want. I completely forgot about it. I completely forgot about that. If we would reload the last autosave. <laughs> it's two days ago. No, nothing is happening right now. Nothing is happening right now. You have not seen anything. Nothing is happening no right now. You are just, I don't know, having visions. Visions of um, weirdness. Vision <laughs> visions of weirdness. <laughs> there we go. Oh, wow, wow. We got a lot of stockpile and shine capitulated and boom, finally we did it. Yay! Not anything at all happened before. So we're gonna do this. We're gonna unmark. Let's see. That single province and hello puppet and then take all state take all state and turn done and hello my dear puppet empire of china uh, we're gonna first improve relationship a tiny bit with you as much as we freaking can and uh, let's see oh raiding fleet so is this a good one for me uh yes Yes, actually, it's a really good, no, not not a really good one, but it's it's decent. And the tank right here, that's the one I want. And let's see, heavy aircraft. Uh, not really anything I want, but it's less research time, so sure. Cool, thank you. Thank you, dear China. And my, well, you still have your plans. I don't know why I wouldn't take the plans when I take over the nation, but uh, all right, all right. Uh, so... The big question right now is, should we just go for Republic of China and begin, or South Korea and Japan? Or should we bring down Russia? I think Russia feels a bit outside my main objective and it would be pushing it a tiny bit too much if I want to go for it. So um, we're instead gonna... Actually, wait, 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 wait. Hmm. Nah, uh, I'm not thinking about invading Russia. I'm just thinking, where the hell should you stand? Because... My frontline division should be right there, not anyone else. Uh, let's just select a random division of you, not you, or a division of you, just, okay, you get, yeah, cool, remove that. <laughs> and let's see, yeah, I think I will mostly put tanks on the very, very front, so three more divisions right there, and then take three of these divisions, move back, and that's basically an equal split now, yeah, good. So all of you get over right here and prepare for the invasion of South Korea. Or actually, 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 we should probably try to go for Japan first. Because the US, it's, it's easier for us to invade South Korea than invading Japan when the US have their fleet standing right here. Hmm. Uh... These divisions need to switch to port to uh, right there, and we need to get, let's see, small ship, naval training, naval experience, everything is the same. We finally get some bonuses right here, but nothing, to, nothing I really want. But I guess the only thing I want right there is naval doctrine, so instead of doing anything right there, let's just get resources, like I said I should. Never mind. Um, we have three more rocket artillery right there. You're gonna be assigned to that eight stack. Yes. Uh, what are these thirteen and six? You are six. Oh right, you were assigned to keep away with naval invasions. God, that was I completely forgot about them. Whoops. Well, that means we have another two tanks. Right, uh, whatever. When I'm having a, having a good split, fifty fifty percent. That's probably a nice division. And we'll just assign you like this. 
and the 24 stack can be slightly under it. Actually, supply-wise, that's... Oh, yeah, supply-wise, that should be completely fine. All right. Yeah, I think it's better if we go for Japan first. Oh, of course, you're doing Fortress Japan now. Did, did you hear what I said or something? And then you said, yeah, Fortress Japan, no. Of course not. They were already most likely doing the focus when I said it. But still, come on. Daniel speaks, AI acts. Stupid. <laughs> um, wait, what? Really? We did get more factories from this, even though we only get 50% now because it's not our core states. Okay, I'm, I'm completely fine with that, like, definitely. Uh, so we're gonna get a couple more tanks, we're gonna get some more mechanized. We are gonna get a couple more fighters, I think. No, actually, we already assigned two lines to that. And we probably need three lines. Uh, but it feels over to overdo it. Um, let's just get more mechanized and tanks. Yeah. There we go, and where are my tanks? Right there, and let's get a 50-50 split right there. Uh, let's in increase the tank, then the motorized, and then we're gonna add two more lines right here. We're getting too many rocket artillery without having the extra defense to be able to defend behind it. So I want a couple more tanks to be able to secure that up. I'm maybe even thinking of adding just one tank right here. Boost up the armor and piercing quite a bit. <sighs> but that would also increase this. So if we remove one rocket artillery, then everything would be pretty goddamn awesome. Oh god, yeah, that would actually increase everything by quite a bit. But we don't have close to enough tanks for that, as yes, if, yes we do. Just adding one modern tank right here actually improves that division by quite a bit. It will protect them against most smaller arms. Yeah, 10 armor, or, well, 40 armor, 46 even. Hello, modern tank. And the game crash. The game just crashed when I did that. It seems like um, it doesn't want me to add in modern tanks to that division. No, I don't want to send a crash right now because what? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. <laughs> what the hell? The game crashes when I try to add a tank. It's like OP division too much. Crash. Come on game. Why you have to be bad? It's just a game. Come on. Come on, let's get back into the game. I'm probably the only YouTuber that ever don't, well, cut away this stuff. And yeah, holy crap. It's also red marked, aka that it's completely bugged out. And we'll have to once again reload with the save from bringing down China. Holy shit. What the hell happened right there? Uh, I'm gonna make a safety save right now, just in case. God damn it, that was, that was harsh. What the hell? Okay, we have another save, and let's just double check that you actually are... Well... Yeah, you are... Why? What the hell? That was weird. Alright, we're just gonna do exactly the same once again. <laughs> and you just have the game running this time. Um, China. Everything. Not that state. Puppet you, Hong Kong, Macau, take all states, take all states, and turn done. Thank you, and then just, yeah, um, U25 divisions, I just did something like this. And let's see, you, I assign, reassigned three of these divisions right there. Took U6, assigned right there too. Then I took one, two, and three divisions right there, assigned right here. I took U24, assigned against South Korea. Um, right here, within this, I took the next resource focus. I went in right here and picked China for all of these. And I think, let's see, yeah, we went here and took the next Nail Doctrine. And anything else? Yes, we set up another... Not Light Tank, not Light Tank, don't even try. Uh, one, two, and Mechanized. One, 
two, uh, full line, half, full line, half. A bit different split now since more factories are destroyed right here. Oh, actually, it should be exactly the same. Yeah, never mind. And let's see. Uh, yeah, and we also fixed our navy. Uh, we said. Oh, actually, we are already done that. Cool. Nice. Uh, let's see where else we're we gonna assign some stuff then. Um, let's just fill out these two. Yep, cool. Um, more divisions are assigned. Yeah, you're gonna be reassigned this stack. And all right, and you guys were assigned just above that one. Supply, it was still in a good region. Yes, even more safety region. And let's see. Hmm, we have these guys. I guess you could for now just be a standing army right here. In case, I don't know, they want to invade us from the other side or something. So yeah, that works pretty good. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I decided on going for Japan, so I shouldn't do that. I should actually start preparing that invasion instead of anything else. Uh, let's see. Should we invade with our best stuff or should we try to invade with our infantry? I think we should try to invade with our infantry because they don't have as massive bonus or negatives going by there. Uh, let's see, come up with 40, they're still pretty good. We have actually a bonus to attack amphibiously. So I think that's the correct choice. Um, we have 24 units, so I think we'll split them up into six stacks. Let's see, invade from here and I want to land somewhere where I can use my tanks. Uh, this seems to be a good area. So, four division, four provinces, one, two, three, four, no, let's do there, one province. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's go from there and invade there. Uh, we need, <laughs> holy crap, we need more just ports right here. Uh, let's see. Let's just get a couple of level three ports right here. And then we can just get a new one right there as well. So we have everything very similar. So yeah, everyone just build up your port and then we'll do the invasions right here beside each other. Come on. Come on, ready up. There you go, another month before that happens. But anyway, um, I will actually have to end this episode right now and right... Well, well, right here, right now, because of work. Um, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, even though we had quite a bit of issues this time. Oh, God, I should probably clean this up. This is kind of ruining my borders. Yeah. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Like and subscribe. Most subscribe. Appreciate it very much. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. And bye.